Not a big deal, I just realized I was streaming the game at 30 frames a second. So I just decided to fix that. Um, Scorpion hits pretty hard. I think even our damage is down a little bit from that, but this guy just happens to hit just that little bit harder. We should have longer, like, grindies, though. Let me peek at the bestiary. Actually, doesn't say like how hard they hit. This guy clearly hits hard, though. Sword next, because that just beyond the, the dreams of avarice. We might we might need to get plates. Cause like these are these guys are gonna hit Ugh The wolves hit hard. would have made a difference, but I guess not.
Two thousand will level again. Starting to get quick defeats. Yeah, we're starting to kind of consistently get over ten damage. Thank you. 
Stay asleep. The enemies actually are quite brutal in like the caves we have to explore. Actually, do the mountain cave first because it's a little bit easier, and then we can take our money for that.
fighter's ring do? Just sells. Probably walk outside before we venture that far in. Should we get at level ugh, level twelve? Brutal. So tedious. <laughs> I'd have skipped the hand axe if the combat was easy enough. isn't anything. Beep, beep, beep. 
Just annoying how luck dependent this is. So dumb. Stop spell is like the, the the thing that we need to use against those. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thou hast learned a new spell. And we'll use it immediately. Yeah, with stop spell, we're gonna run ragged. Okay, we do get defensive power from leveling up. you now. Following the guy at the moment.
doesn't mention the mountain cave this walkthrough. Alright, we need six magic keys. Curious what Remidlar looks like. Four defense for level isn't messing around too much. Five damage, so we're starting to get to the threshold for these enemies. Thank you. 
These enemies are nothing. If, if I can get strong enough to if I get strong enough to reach Hawkness, I can get Erdrick's armor. Which would effectively put the rest of the game on easy mode. Now my guess is we're not strong enough to get it yet. So these chests are worth anywhere between 24 and um, 52 gold, which is what we call a bad investment. Trying to get that um, guy, like, yeah, he's down here. We do need to open this door. Having done that, we'll replace the magic key immediately. found that castle cellar. Yep. 
We're into the cellar. We long for one such as thee. Take the treasure chest. Let's find the stones of sunlight. That second key door isn't... It's not worth anything, really. The keys are 53, and you can get a maximum of 52 gold from those chests. The four chests. You, you will never receive enough gold to replace the keys. to um stupid I forgot to get my MP back and I forgot to save the game both of those things and then we will um we'll head out It should be a leisurely stroll. Um, Erdrick's armor is a little bit lower in Hawkness. 
We just don't have much prospect of um, actually grabbing that right now. sure you could just restock these like at will Probably incorrect. There doesn't seem to be anything in here, actually. Repeat this dungeon, I'm pretty sure. Another one of those things is all that exciting. This 
part's easy. Nothing life-threatening here. Yeah, if I need armor, I can't at this point do much better than I am. Two more levels for we get outside. We're gonna we're gonna start seeing some enemies that are more powerful. Towards Hawkness. We might be able to fight some wyverns and stuff. Got 42 HP. <laughs> Talk about a Thank you. 
Okay. Yeah, gold just destroys us. We'll buy as many herbs as we physically can hold. And we'll try to knock out this. We're like way too weak at the moment. For the Hawkness area. Goldman just obliterated me. Could put the Wyvern to sleep, which is one thing, but... We should easily level up inside, too. We've got kind of a, a tough little area. another herb, I'm pretty sure. Harp attracts enemies. Stay away from the grave of Garenheim. Alright, I need to follow a map pretty precisely here. start from one and we have chest containing herbs It's tricky the uh, the deeper in we get. Thou found the herb. What does the cursed belt do? I'm just curious.
The curse belt sells, but... There's a small chance of a, uh... Of a cursed necklace that's worth actually a lot of money in the, um, mountain cave. Now we're kind of committed. We have three chances. Three cracks at this, really. Spends a lot of time just casting magic. Belt. I mean, a draw magi. I assume it, yeah, it casts magic. This is like attrition. stop spell so we should stop it. Here. 
I think this one does sometimes use hurt. get to the upper levels, it isn't as bad. We just have to, like, survive. Above floor three. Assuming we can do that, it's gravy. Alright, that's the hard part. sleep at the end. The mountain cave sometimes gives a cursed necklace on level 2, which is worth... what is it worth? 1200. Status. 
is 40 defense. Lucky we can like try to grind gold in that area. Not generally my first choice though. We got our armor up by like six points. That might actually like get us somewhat over the threshold. It certainly made going through that cave easier. And, um, damage output. kind of doesn't. Yeah, we need a couple more levels. Okay. 
we can we can get that now. And I think that's kind of where I'm going. We should be able to get a level, at least. Forty defense. Each subsequent level up does increase our defensive values. So it's not the worst thing in the world. lock our progress in. God, what level do we learn, like, good spells at? Heal more is at 17, Jesus. so hard to get. I suspect I'm going to go into Garen's grave to grind. It's more expensive to restock keys here, but it's kind of the way to do it, because it saves us a really, really long walk. Experience points might as well be forever. I might get it when I get to the coal region. And the rainbow drop, I'm just looking up. Mm-hmm. 
Full plate might just be what we need to... Or half plate. Might be what we need to survive in Garen's grave. It's kind of the best grinding spot right now. I think when we hit the next level, we're going to be like 1100 from the next level. The treasure chest. The Staff of Rain. Progression across the swamp is the same as the one in Garen's grave. Next thing to do would probably just be to kill the dragon. Although that won't be easy. Oh, 65. I guess it's doable. Maybe it's doable around level 12. shaking my head. Why are we... Just kill him. The game does stupid crap like that to extend the battles all the time. Just saving some states. Same as full plate, but raises HP. Thank <laughs> you. 
threshold is. That gets us over it. Probably like level 12. Kill the dragon, come back, and then like... and receiving 42 defense be surprised if the skeleton even hurts us now a little bit and when I come down here and just gain levels gain probably just like a level too long before we um, have access to The objective is to get the objective is to get enough for a full plant we can do it pretty quickly by being down here. By the time we have that we can probably just walk down to the area we need to. Yeah, the 
the magic armor is pretty worthless in this game because it quickly gets replaced by Erdrick's armor, which is just much better. threshold was going to be pretty important. If you get enough gold, man, you're in good shape. trivialize a lot. Once you hit the attack thresholds of the enemies, that the amount of damage you start taking just reduces by so much. You just have to get there. Yeah, 
Everything down here. Yeah, once you get down here, like, full plate armor is feasible. Jesus. Yeah, we gotta be careful because if we die, we have to earn this gold all over again. Care. 
just a pain in the ass to get, like, equipment. Are there no items in this area? That's really unlucky. Seven. I should not be doing that type of damage to me. Just trivial. Yeah, this guy like does stop spell, which we don't we don't care. I probably won't care as much, like once we have the full plate, I can just work down here as long as I like. Thank <laughs> you. 
We're straight up murdering wolf lords now without any trouble. Twenty EXP each. Full plate, I can probably take on the dragon too. Make a run at at level 12. defense. I'm going to try to skip the magic armor. I, I just don't think that transition is necessary. Eight defensive points should make a huge difference down here. If he ever hits us. Yeah. Eight points, and that pretty much like cuts our damage in half. Significant. Just huge. We do get defense every level, so it's not, it's not like it's a waste. Yeah, the full plate. You can get the magic armor, but the full plate seems completely necessary. I still want to grind up the gold for the magic armor when we can just get Erdrick's armor and Hawksness. Yeah, 
full plate is just... That is where we need to be. give us levels. Just lots of gold. Still six damage from that thing, huh? Careful, because the right the, the wyverns are powerful. And not even worth that much more. I want now, not whatever. Thank <laughs> you. 
more fight any fight Outside. It's a big level, too. are such a pain. Dragon is the only hard enemy in this. Ah, 
Ah, we should save. I accidentally loaded the goddamn state. Which takes me back to having fucking half plate armor. the wrong damn buttons. God, I saved, wanted to save state to make sure that I didn't remember the damn buttons. That's infuriating. triangle which loads. It's absolutely stupid. to do it again? I mean, I will, but not now. There's the correct, there's the correct sequence. Right, I'm out of here for the night. I thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed, if you haven't, haven't already done so. Feel free to follow me one time. Still like and share if you're on the YouTube end of things. Um... We'll, we'll be pinging away like on a third edition of this one. We'll get our full plate back. We'll get to level 12 and, um... Yeah, I guess. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Till, till next time, take care. Have a great one.
later on guys.